Hey. Hmm. How's it going? Hmm. Yes. How's it going? Hmm. What'd you say? Right.
Yeah? Thank you. Need something? Need something? Thank you kindly. Welcome back. Many thanks. It is a most difficult time for all of us right now. We mourn the death of our beloved High Commander Isoro, the one man in whom we all placed our trust. But now more than ever, I know that he would want us to push forward. The finest way we can honor his legacy is to bring a swift end to this conflict as quickly as possible. Where is Kaspar? How dare you interrupt His Majesty, the King! It's fine. Tell him. Kaspar has recalled his troops to Illinois. Evidently, with his sorrow dead, he believes we're not worth his time. I have no interest in his thoughts. The only thing I care about is taking his life with my bare hands. Surely you don't intend to pursue him behind enemy lines. I cannot approve of that. The Kingdom of Benario cannot afford to lose another Fenice. Not right now. I wasn't asking your permission. I will be departing with my personal forces immediately. Wait. You are too precious to us to lose. But I cannot stop you from doing what you feel you must. Take as many troops as you require. However, I offer them under the condition that you accept Cristobal as High Commander from here on out. It's not that I don't trust you, but to lose your uncle and then have to shoulder his burden... Do as you wish, I don't care. All that matters to me is claiming Kaspar's head. We'll be on our way as well, Your Majesty. 
How dare you! Wait just a minute! As for you, I have something to suggest. Yes, Your Majesty. I would like you to head to the Imperial capital, Lyriar. At the moment, the majority of the Empire's fighting forces are with Kaspar in Lenoi. Centralizing their power makes them a formidable force, but it could also be their greatest downfall. With all their energy devoted to suppressing the rebels, the capital itself is all but defenseless. Didn't you just offer Ballastar whatever support he needs? I did. Which is why I can only supply you with a small number of troops. Trying to take the capital single-handed? That's quite a gamble. But if we don't take risks, how can we hope to topple an empire? Even so, it's dangerous. If we get caught between Kaspar and the capital, we'll be completely isolated. If you feel the risk is too great, I will not order you to go. Perhaps you could go with Commander Ballastar instead? I'll see it done, Your Majesty. Cap! Good. I recommend you prepare as quickly as possible. Brother, are you, you sure we can trust his word? What do you mean? That if you conquer the capital, the king will give it to you as a reward. I doubt it. He was probably just saying that. <laughs> but still, if you're in charge of the whole city, that'd make you a lord, right? At this point, I'd settle for just getting through this alive. So why'd you agree to it, then? I know it's a risk. But as far as I'm concerned, taking orders from a guy blinded by his own bloodlust is way more dangerous. I'd rather trust us to do something impossible than deal with Ballastar for one more second. The only question is, how are we gonna get through his sets? If we want to reach the capital, we'll have to cut through as quickly as possible. Should we try to bypass it? I've heard another rebel faction has just taken over the city. Supposedly, they're led by a man named Corral. They're likely still establishing their presence in the region. I imagine they'd be grateful if we simply passed them by. There's another group kicking around that area, too. Mercenaries. Led by someone called Emil. Ah. Friend of yours? I wouldn't say that, but in our circles, he's about as well known as Clara. Emile's people have a strong reputation. They're good at what they do, and they're not picky about who they do it for. We should keep an eye on them. The Empire might be our biggest concern, but you never know who we'll be fighting later. For now, it's probably best to avoid an altercation if we can. Eden! Monsters are approaching from a nearby meadow! Monsters? On flatlands like these? What kind? I I'm not sure. It's something I've never seen before. Let's go find out.
That's... An Aspida! Perfect. What better time for a new weird monster? Hey, uh, does anybody know how to fight these things? Cause I sure don't. The only advice I've ever heard is run. Be wary of its long tail and venom. If enough of you are lined up in front of it, you will all be sent flying. And you are? Defeat this creature and I shall tell you. And be careful. These devils thrive in wet environments. We must lure it onto dry ground. Faith will never betray me. Sure thing, Cap. No matter how careful you are, all it takes is one mistake. Don't fight smarter, fight harder! Go ahead, open your mouth. I'll put an arrow in it. Acknowledged. The destination doesn't matter. It's the people you're with. Can do. You got it, kid. Understood. Blood runs hot. Keep your head cool. Let's roll! Um, where are we going again? You got it, Cap. As long as Sarah's safe, this whole world can rot. Right. Sure thing. A lady Marshall. I'll see it through. Here goes! Not everyone can be forgiven.
Should have been more careful. Right! Mind the bow. Let's get it done. The fight, the sweeter the victory. Out of sight, but not out of mind. starts racing, slow down and take a moment. The stronger the heart, the sharper the blade. Light burns the brightest in the dark. Francisco the Bold has arrived! It's a shame, spilling blood on such a nice day.
I can handle that. Whether words or swords, I miss nothing. Simple enough. No problem! There is no mountain too high to climb. Think deeply. Act quickly. A solid plan. Know what fools and drunks have in common? Loud and clear. As you command. It's up to me. Plans are like booze. Only good till they run out. I will bring justice to this land. People who run their mouths die first. Coming right up. Understood. Luck is on my side. No sweat. I may not be smart, but I know how to hurt. The stronger the heart, the sharper the blade. Right! No problem! starts racing, slow down and take a moment. As long as Sarah's safe, this whole world can rot. Let's get it done. Right. A solid plan. You got it, kid. Out of sight, but not out of mind. It's up to me. You got it! Go ahead, open your mouth. I'll put an arrow in it. Sure thing, Cap. <sighs> Should have been more careful. There is no mountain too high to climb. Simple enough. As you command. 
I'll see it through. Francisco the Bold has arrived! Sure thing. Faith will never betray me. Here we go! Understood. Acknowledged. If you say so. I can handle that. Ah! You got it, Cap. Sarah's safe, this whole world can rot. the Anaspida's wretched spawn. If you don't want to deal with hungry hatchlings, I recommend you dispose of it. Ruthless but clever. Works for me. Everyone, target that egg! Proceed carefully. That egg has a dangerous energy about it. Don't worry about us. Where there's a will, there's a way. Oh, 
damn it. What a pain. So... It's a shame, spilling blood on such a nice day. Whether words or swords, I miss nothing. Prey sighted. <laughs> Not everyone can be forgiven. Runs hot. Keep your head cool. Faith will never betray me. Think deeply. Act quickly. No matter how careful you. Right! Lady Marcel. I can handle that. to me. Luck is on my side. Huh. Huh. Should have been more careful. No sweat. The harder the fight, the sweeter the victory. Swords. I miss nothing. As you command. This was one mountain too many.
Know what fools and drunks have in common? They never learn. Out of sight, but not out of mind. Here we go. Go ahead, open your mouth. I'll put an arrow in it. People who run their mouths die first. Understood. When your heart starts racing, slow down and take a moment. Sure thing, Cap. When your heart starts racing, slow down and take a moment. The stronger the heart, the sharper the blade. Yeah, yeah. Loud and clear. People who run their mouths die first. Light burns the brightest in the dark. to me. Think deeply, act quickly. I'll see it through. Techno! 
acknowledged. You got it, Cap. The harder the fight, the sweeter the victory. Let's get it done. Out of sight, but not out of mind. You got it, Cap. Go ahead, open your mouth. I'll put an arrow in it. As long as Sarah's safe, this whole world can rot. Faith will never betray me. If your blood runs hot, keep your head cool. Right. A solid plan. You got it, kid. Whether words or swords, I miss nothing. Luck is on my side. It's a shame. Spilling the stronger the heart, the sharper the blade. Here we go. I can handle that.
so. I'm Eden. You have my gratitude for helping us back there. I am called Albrecht. I've got some skills. How is it I've never heard of you? Until recently, I've been studying magic and hiding. Who's your master? Maybe I've heard of them. <laughs> I don't doubt it. His name is Verno. Oh, <laughs> now there's one I haven't heard in a while. Who is that? The Archmage of the Cornelian Spire, the center of all magical study, before the Emperor burned it to the ground. The other mages called him a coward for it. After the Empire took over, he just up and vanished. Where's he at now? Sadly, he has departed from this world. That is why I've come out of hiding. To finish the work my master started. And... what kind of work was that? Everyone is waiting for you in the operations area. Understood. I'll head there shortly. Yes, sir. What is it? Hmm.
Hey, need something? Hi there. Ha. <laughs> ah. You betcha. Need something? Had a chance to look around? Like what you see? As a matter of fact, I do. Promising operation you've got here. I'm just about ready to join, as soon as you meet my terms. Your terms? Sure. You didn't think I'd be joining for free, did you? I thought you came here looking for adventure. Adventure's nice, but coin is nicer. Well, I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but this is mostly a volunteer army. Most of what we earn goes right back into supplies and equipment. Oh, I'm well aware. You're talking to a supplier. Believe it or not, I've already had my share of dealings with the Benarian army, peddling food and medicine to valiant soldiers in need. And I was so moved by the cause, I did something I never do. Sell on credit. Uh-oh. I don't like where this is going. Now, now. No need to fret. Just settle this little invoice and we're square. All right. Let me see it. 700 gold? Who ran up a debt like that? I can't keep all these identical-looking meatheads straight. The name's at the bottom. You figure it out. Now get moving. Time is money, and mine's worth a lot. Hey, need something? Hmm. Um. Uh. Hmm. Sorry about that. Huh. <sighs> Hey. What's got you so deep in thought? I was thinking about his sets. A sets? Why? Just seems like a waste to pass by without stopping. They say the blacksmiths there make the best equipment in Artemisia. Sure, everybody knows that. But now's not the time for sightseeing, Leon. I'm not just spouting colorful information for the sake of it, Eden. I'm saying, don't you think some new gear might make things easier? All right, all right. Still, it might be risky to get too close to the sets. I'll check in with the merchants. Hey. Hmm. Interesting. Hmm. I'm listening. Can't thank you enough. Hmm. Huh. 
Sure. Yes. Uh, well... <laughs> Anything catch your eye? I've heard that arms and armor from Hassets are top notch. Do you happen to have any? There's nothing that I can't get. However, there are certain things I'm unable to sell. And this is one of those things? Yes, unfortunately. I've got a few items, but they're currently on hold for another client. Is there anything I can do to change your mind? A good merchant never breaks an accord. However, if you can offer me something enticing enough in return, I may bend my principles just this once. Something enticing, huh? All right, let me see what I can do. Anything catch your eye? You're much too kind, dear. Hey. So, how did it go? Salma's got what we need, but it's spoken for. Unless we can find something more valuable. Maybe an Aspida? What? We hunted some an Aspida recently. Why not offer her that? What would she want with a carcass? Did I say you should dump the whole thing on her? It's got rare parts. Let's harvest those. I don't know. Anaspidas are rare, but is it really worth all that? Can't hurt to find out. Let's go talk to the blacksmith. I want to process crafting materials from an Anaspida. Is that possible? What did you have in mind? The scales. The scales, huh? Well, they're pretty tough. I'm not sure my hammer will do the trick. I'll give it a try. Please, wait a moment. Here you are, sir. Much appreciated. Remind me to buy you a drink sometime. Anything catch your eye? Ah, this is high quality work. Most mercenaries would just drop a severed head in my lap and call it a day. You're much more savvy than I thought. Whether it's business or battle, you've got to stay one step ahead to survive. Your wit is wasted on war, boy. If you ever get tired of waging war, you ought to join me. I appreciate the offer, but you'll have to wait in line. I'm a pretty hot commodity around here myself. Say no more. Here you are. Genuine Hassets made equipment. Pleasure doing business.
Welcome back. Hey, Porter. I was wondering if you could help me with something. Let me guess. Stella's Bill? All right. You two know each other. Any chance you can help me make sense of this thing? Sure. Let's take a look. Let's see. Chocolate, ale, jerky. Oh my, someone threw quite the party, didn't they? Yeah, and I can't read their name at the bottom. It looks like... maybe Orlando? Orlando? Who's that? No idea. You don't recognize the name? No. I wonder if they're even part of our troop. Zarveril might be able to help. He keeps detailed logs of every sale he makes. Got it. Thanks, Porter. No problem. But, uh, if I were you, I'd get that bill taken care of as soon as possible. Stella acts nice, but she used to run a whole merchant's guild. She knows how to make life difficult for people who don't settle their debts. Right. Thanks for the warning. How may I assist you? Zarvaril, how's business? Mm, busy as always, but I can't complain. I was wondering if you've had any dealings with a soldier named Orlando. I'm trying to settle a bill for another merchant, but that name's not familiar to me. One sec, I'll check my logbook. Hmm, I'm not seeing anyone by that name here. Hopefully they didn't give this merchant a fake name. That happens sometimes. A fake name, huh? Okay, I know just who to talk to. Hey. All right, fess up. You're Orlando, aren't you? Excuse me? Somebody calling themselves that has been running up bills on credit, using the Benarian army's name. What makes you think I've got anything to do with it? Oh, I don't know. Maybe that time when we were kids. You did the same thing to that toy shop owner in Mora. Pout, you need to get your memory checked. That was you who did that. Don't try to confuse me! You're already confused. Orlando's not a fake name, you dummy. He's one of the auxiliary archers. Oh. Uh, right. Sorry. Don't worry about it. I'm used to you being stupid by now. Yeah? Yeah. Hey, which one of you is Orlando? Uh, why? Because I've got a merchant who says he owes her a lot of money. Oh man, I don't know what I should do here. Is it you? No, sir. Orlando was my bunkmate. He bought all that stuff for us to celebrate after the battle in Aliche. I think he planned to pay it back eventually, but he's... Not around anymore. Oh no. Don't tell me. He was hurt pretty badly in cures and... I... I was there with him when he passed. 
None of us have the money to cover that bill, sir. I'm so sorry. No, I'm sorry. Forget I brought it up. Yes, sir. Was he a good soldier? No, sir. His aim was terrible. But he was a good friend. Hey, need something? Stella. Ah, uh, my debt collector returns. How goes your task? I tracked down that soldier who owed you money. He's dead. Oh, I'm, uh, I'm so sorry to hear that. Me too. But I have your invoice now. I can't pay it right this moment, but if you're willing to wait a few weeks... Forget it. Huh? The debt. It's a race. Poof. Just like that? What can I say? I knew the risk selling on credit. I'll eat the cost. Besides, between the two of us, I think he paid the higher price. That's kind of you. Thanks. Nah, uh, don't mention it. I mean, seriously, don't mention it. I've got a reputation to uphold. Need something? Hmm. Duh. Hmm. Sure. How's it going? Hmm. Yeah. Mm -mm. How's it going? Thanks. Yeah? Hmm. 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 All right. Let me think about it. <clears throat> Hi there. What do you mean? <laughs> hmm. What? <laughs> All right.
Welcome. Hmm. We are of a similar mind. Indeed. <laughs> ah. Sure. I thank you. Welcome. Hmm. Yes. Hmm. <laughs> right. I thank you. Sir, this will go a long way. Can you tell me more about your master's studies? His research, simply put, was an inquiry into the source of magic itself. The source of magic? That's all I can tell you at the moment. But you and I will discuss this matter again. Does that mean... Yes. I will accompany you henceforth. That's great and all, but... Can I ask why? I believe you are the key to something I've been searching for. Alas, I'm afraid I'm not prepared to elaborate just now. He's saying you smell funny. Like I said when we first met. I've heard that Verno was not only the head of the Spire, but one of the greatest strategists in Artemisia. He would have been a great asset to us, if only for that alone. Though I do not pretend to be his equal, I have studied in that area as well. Oh, you studied it, huh? From hiding, you mean? You know there's a real war going on, right? I have ascertained as much, yes. The Kingdom of Benario marches on Lyriar, correct? How could you possibly... Given that you've made camp, I don't believe you have any intentions of attacking his sets. Judging from your force's direction and speed, the capital is the next most logical assumption. Ha! Well, that's good enough for me. All right then, what's to think about? Welcome aboard. Yes. Hmm. <laughs> Yes. Um... Hmm. Certainly. Mm. Need something? I'm very curious about that young fellow's talents, magically speaking. Don't you think he proved himself enough in battle? And then some. Which makes me even more curious. I have to admit, I'm curious myself. Why not go ask him about it? I wouldn't even know where to start. When it comes to a proper spell-slinger like that, 
I'll wager he's done a bit of writing. Go ask if he's got any books under his belt. Need something? Hmm. Now, let's see here. Hmm. <sighs> Welcome. Is there something I can help you with? Someone told me real wizards write books, or something. Do you have anything like that? <laughs> Certainly. See for yourself. Is this kind of thing normal? All this magic stuff is a little beyond me. It's simpler than you might think. You may borrow it if you wish. Thanks. I will. Welcome. <sighs> hmm. Yes. <laughs> ah. Uh-huh. I thank you. Need something? So, what do you think? Well, for someone so young, kids got incredible insight. When I was his age, all I cared about was getting drunk. I wasn't asking for tavern stories, old man. You got no damn respect for your elders, you know that? Anyway, I'll keep a close eye on him. Let you know what I find. What else is there to learn? You've already seen him fight. An old man's memory is like a dream in spring. What? Blink, and it's gone. Now quit asking dumb questions and get ready for the next fight. Welcome. Hi there. Mm hmm. Ah. Intriguing. Hmm. Yes. Hmm.
Much appreciated. Welcome. I thank you. Yeah! <laughs> 